Well, these have been uncertain times, and if you are in the festival business, down one year, coming back the next, only to see COVID cases resurge. But there is some good news tonight, especially when the loving, giving local crew stops by. Scott Bremner has more on the sweet music coming from this week's award. For nearly 30 years now, Erie's summers have ended on a high note. A lot of them, in fact, with the Erie Blues and Jazz Festival, featuring some of the best blues and jazz acts around. It's a time to just relax and enjoy the music. Artistic director John Vanko knows all about the relaxing power of this music, which is why he believes that this year, more than ever, the show must go on. I hope everybody's going to plan to join us that last weekend of September. The weather's going to be beautiful and we're going to have a great time. Helping to fuel that good time is the random drawing of the $250 Loving Giving Local Award that will help the Blues and Jazz Committee pay for the visiting jazz and blues artists. So for us to uh, be able to support this event in that way and to know that our funds that we've delivered today will be put to good use paying for some of the performers, uh, to me that makes it special and that's what Loving Giving Local is all about. It's giving back to the community and we're happy to be here today. What randomly drawn charity will be the next to benefit from the Loving Giving Local $250 award? Tune in Wednesday morning to find out. Scott Bremner, Jet 24, Action News.